I see the Pelicans in New Orleans. Like the Nets too. I'm about to do a quick get ready with me for Brooklyn Nets versus New Orleans Pelicans game. The Pelicans this year are kind of like a Duke super team of the NBA. Basketball games are tricky. You want to do a look casual at the same time, I guess. I'm going to start with skincare, Luzerne serum. My eyebrows, I bleached them for Halloween. I dried them back so dark and it's driving me crazy. What are you gonna do? It's really tricky to lighten them once they've gone too dark. You can go really orangey. Oh, boom, they'll fade out. Charlotte's Magic Cream. Oh, well, it's open. Warm it up. I like the way this texture works under makeup. Gotta step up my courtside looks game. Well, I don't know if I'm actually sitting courtside. <laughs> The world is your runway. What am I talking about? Favorite trick. My dad was in town this weekend. I was showing him around and we did an architecture tour in New York City. My lips got so chapped from the wind. These amazing Kiko wipes are the best exfoliating wipes that I've found. Once in a while, you need a good scrub. I almost don't even want to tell you guys, but I'm gonna tell you. I hate it when you get that lipstick drying out your mouth situation. It's not cute. Like my nails right now. Who has the time? <laughs> lip sleeping mask really fills in the lines on your lips and hydrates them. It's perfect if you want to put a liner or a lipstick on top of it because it actually stays. Let that absorb. What's going on with this hair? I'm using my beauty blender. I really want to keep the skin light and dewy. I'm using Charlotte Tilbury Magic Foundation, Dr. Hauschka Illuminating Fluid, a little glow, and Dr. Hauschka Bronzing Tint. I didn't put that much on. This is Charlotte Tilbury's Retoucher Concealer Stick. I like to get in there with my fingers. A little bit of clay de peau. Making it all kind of one color around the mouth. I think it's good to work with your fingers when you don't want to go for a heavy look. I'm going to do like a blonder color in the brow. Brush them down, that's my little trick. I knew something was missing. I'm also really hungry. I apologize if I sound hangry. All I can think about is getting chicken tenders. Oh, red blonde. Brow, pencil, and blonde. I don't know if they look blonder, but maybe a bit more sculpted. Once I start playing with eyebrows, I just keep playing. It's like, okay, where did she just take this? My stomach is like, ooh, the monster's in there. Dark brows are really throwing me. Like, I have to switch up my makeup. It needs a little extra something, something. Oh God, doing this in this mirror is hard. I find one of the most difficult parts about doing liner is getting really tight to the lash line, especially on yourself. It's not something I do often. <laughs> it's not perfect, but there's some definition. It's stressful. I feel like there's no way to look attractive while I do this. So. Sorry about that, guys. It's hard not to have a gap between your lid and your eyelid. Makeup artists like to use a pot with a flat brush. Right now, using this feline flick. Get in there, I'm messing with it, and I'm gonna mess it up. Why do we do this to ourselves? Step away from the liner. Going bronze is the only way I can deal with my dark eyebrows. An obstacle for me, if you can't tell. The Tarte palette, I've used it a lot. Just a little bit, like a subtle taupey pop. I like to accentuate the outer edges of my eyes. I feel like it makes them more feline. That just intensified. This is just how I am when I'm hungry. What I'm gonna do next, curl my lashes. I got work to do, I'm getting distracted. Funny thing is, I do try to plan out a little bit for these videos. <laughs> Can't even get it together for that. I hope JJ Reddick shoots a lot of threes. I think it's coming together, but I can't see if I even have my lashes in this thing. All right. That just makes me feel like it won't be as heavy. I don't know, mascara. I do enjoy learning about new products until I find a new one and I move on. Right now, I'm really into this Armani one. No expert in doing my makeup. I hate that you have to see up my nose. It's too tall. Trying to get to the root of the lash. My other new obsession is this liner. There's a nice highlight in it, but I might be making that up. When I wear it, I feel like it reflects light and makes my lips look poofier. I always need a Q-tip to clean up liner. The one thing that is for certain, if I overdraw the bottom lip, it's a disaster. It's just, there's a proportion thing there and it looks crazy. But everyone's lip shape's different, obviously. Okay, I'm gonna smooth that out. 
Oh, I'm almost there. Gold highlighter. Giorgio Armani fluid shoe. I really can't be late to this game. Oh, coral. Coral's my thing right now. Nice, apricot-y, corally. Charlotte Tilbury, beach stick. That color is poppin'. Good, complimentary palette. You know, just a day at the beach at the beginning of November. If you're going courtside, you gotta give a look. I keep saying that, but I don't know if I'm courtside. <laughs> Probably not. A lip. Makeup's just stressful today. Between this color, and this darker color. This might be too light. Mm. Yeah, I feel like it's lighter than my natural color. Go with an old favorite of mine. Velvet Matte and Wanted. I like it because it's a brown 90s color. For some reason that's hard to find. Lip brush. Find it helpful to apply lip stuff with the brush. This Chanel one is the perfect size. I can't believe my boyfriend hasn't come in here yet to rush me. Oh my God, here right now. Much there. Just gotta figure out my outfit, but it's, it's fine. Okay, here, so many things. I'm gonna brush it. <laughs> A little greasy, but I'm out of dry shampoo. It smells really good. Whoa. Time to get dressed. Love a throwback windbreaker set. A little windbreaker kind of dress that I haven't figured out the right place to wear it to. Or, can't go wrong with a classic oversized champion hoodie. Denim options. Vintage. A white champion oversized sweatshirt. And I'm gonna go try this on. To pull off a casual outfit at a basketball game, you kinda have to floss it out with some jewelry. Yeah. Figure it out. Black or white with this? They kind of look like a parachute, though. Yeah, yeah too much. I like the red, though. Ooh, the Air Max is with the white. Oh shit! No you, no you didn't! No you didn't! <laughs>